What up, guys? It's your boy Chance. I'm back. Um, or some of you guys might know me as Dark Blade, Shadow Blade, whatever you guys know me as. Also, man, post link comments what you guys are sipping on, man. I'm just sitting here sipping on some nice cold iced tea. Y'all know what I drink already during live streams. It's either coffee or iced tea, one of the two. Oh, sorry about that. But um, I do have something that I do want to talk to you guys about that's it's really important. You know, because not only does this have to do with my music, but it has to do with me, you know, physically and mentally, as well as health-wise. And it's something that is, like, a lot of people don't realize. So let me invite people in. And we will seriously talk about this. Like, and I'm not blaming anybody, but this is just something that, like, I feel like needs to be put out there and something that I really need to talk about. And that is why I need a break from music. Now, don't get it twisted. I'm not quitting music. But I don't know if you guys know this or not. But I've not taken a vacation for myself. Or done, like, you know, I've not taken a break to do my own stuff for a while. And to relax and be normal for a while in almost two to three years now. And like I said, that's the way it's fault. It's just, you know, me overworking myself. And everybody expects me to just, you know, do my music every day. But here's the thing. I'm an artist. I don't just produce beats. I write. I record everything and if i'm not at a hundred percent how can i give you guys my listeners my fans my friends the best of my music like how can i do that when i'm not at a hundred percent i have not taken a break for myself in many years now it's just always been just go 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 24 7. Literally, the only time I really had off are the holidays and at night. That's the only time I've not taken a full-on vacation ever. And something you guys might not realize is that that exhausts a body. Getting up, repeating, recording every day. That shit exhausts your body. And if... I'm exhausted and not at my best at 100%. How am I supposed to perform at my best for you guys? You know, like, I need a vacation. Like, if I'm not sane, if I'm not mentally there, like, if I'm not, you know, like, how do I put this? Like, if I'm not, you know, normal in my head, and I'm not, like, there, how am I supposed to write and record anything good for you guys? And plus, also, like, you guys gotta understand, too, you know, like, you know, I did just lose one of my best friends, Coda not that long ago like literally like a couple weeks ago so you know that does have a lot to do with it and yes I know I need to get over his death I get that but you also got to think too though Mike and the guys of Lincoln Park they're going through the same situation with Chester even though it's been almost a year And I know I need to force myself to get back in and record and stuff like that. And 
in these last few days, I've done nothing but, you know, write beats nonstop. And honestly, I need a break, guys. The last time I was ever really normal was literally like three, four years ago. Do I regret doing music or going into the music business? No. I absolutely love it. Like, you know, it's something I enjoy doing. I'm able to vent what's really going on in my life through my music. I'm able to talk about real stuff in my life. But honestly, guys, how do you expect me to perform at 100% when I'm straight out exhausted? That's why I'm trying to take a break and relax and, you know, just be normal and, you know, also focus on doing other stuff, you know, like my artwork and also, you know, my YouTube gaming channel. Like, I might not look it, guys, but I am totally, I'm far from 100% right now. I'm like at 15%. Like I said, am I quitting music? No. But it pisses me the fuck off when all these different people just got me running 24-7 all day long. Yes, I have a manager alongside my brother Eric Scrubblo who works for Psychopathic Records, which I'm glad about that. I'm happy to be a part of that. Because as you guys know, Psychopathic's one of the largest if not the largest underground record label in the country or in the world. And yes, I'm happy part, to be part of their, you know, side thing called Dollhouse Radio. I'm happy to be part of that. Like, I'm beyond words of being honored. Yes, my stuff's going to be on their internet radio show alongside my brothers. But, you know, aside, outside of that, you know, I do need a break. Like, I've not really sat down to really dig into stuff that I want to do outside of it. Like, outside of the music scene in a very long time, and it's... You know, it's hard to deal with. Like I said, I know I need to get back into the studio and record. And believe me, I am. I'm working on little stuff here and there. But honestly, for the most part, I need a break. Because losing sleep like this, staying up all night doing this shit, is exhausting. It takes its toll on you over time. And believe me, I want to take a break so fucking bad. Like, y'all don't even know how much hard work that I've put out these last two to three years. You got to figure, guys. I did the shot of Blood Cypher with my brother Ian and our label Bloodshot Records, along with guys like Young Fox. I've done stuff with my boy Young Fox. I've done stuff for my brother Eric. I've done videos on top of video on top of video for the music scene i've done you know instrumentals out the ass i've recorded my ass off just non-stop and honestly i need a break so i don't fucking lose my head so i don't lose my cool so i don't ruin these opportunities like the one i've got now Because like I said, I'm not pissed off at anybody. I'm really not. So if I am pissing you off by trying to take a break, I do apologize. But you got to understand. Doing this shit 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, that's exhausting on a body. Both mentally and physically, that's not good. Oh yeah, I do get sleep. I really do. But it's very, very little and it's broken up a lot. 
And it's because people just don't understand that I need a break. I'm an artist. I can't just up and snap my fingers and do something. No, I have to let the inspiration come to me when writing. Like, you know, I'm not a robot that can just spit out random stuff like that. Like, that's not me. That's not how I work. I'm a true artist. I get inspired by things, and that inspiration needs to come to me before I can even think about writing anything good. Because like I said, I don't want to be sitting here six months from now, sicker than a damn dog, not able to record, not able to do anything for you guys because I didn't take a break. And believe me, not sleeping can cause you to get sick. It's happened to me a couple times before. And trust me, it's not fun being, you know, laying up in bed wanting to record, but you're not able to do anything. That sucks. Like I said, I don't blame anybody. I'm not quitting music. I'm truly not. I just need some time for myself, for my friends, my family, and just be normal. And, you know, and work on, you know, my gaming channel for my YouTube and, you know, binge watch TV and relax and be normal. Because that being normal, that sense of being normal is something that, you know, I have not had in almost two to three years now. Because I've always been working on stuff just 24-7, 365. Hell, first thing I did when I got this Chromebook that I have now, first thing I did was jump on and start making music with it. And that was back in December. I mean, you guys got to figure, before that, you know, I had my computer, which that went dead quickly, so then all I had was my Kindle. And I was even doing music on that, and, you know, it wasn't easy. Granted, yes, I am very thankful for this Chromebook. Don't get me wrong, I absolutely love Chromebooks. They're awesome. But, you know, if I'm not physically and mentally well, if I'm not physically doing fine or mentally okay, and I'm not all there, how am I supposed to put out good music for you guys? Like I said, I'm not quitting. I just, I need a break. Every band and artist needs a break every now and then. Everybody needs a break. Because you can't just run 24-7 on fucking spin cycle nonstop. And granted, yeah, I know that spin cycle, doing that all the time 24-7 is what gets you somewhere. I get it. Because you forget, guys, that I'm that person that does that. I'm that artist that just keeps it going just non-fucking-stop. All day long, every day, all night. Even in my sleep, I keep that shit going. Literally, in my sleep, I keep that shit going. I just keep on popping out ideas. But eventually, if I don't take a break, I could end up, you know, sick. I can end up in the hospital without a voice. And I don't think you guys want that. I know I don't want that to happen. So from this point on, I am taking a break from the music scene starting right now, tonight, and well, actually starting tomorrow, now-ish. I am taking a break. Well, actually, it is tomorrow already. Never mind. So as of right now, I am taking a break from the music scene to just be normal for a bit. You know, work on some of my artwork and, you know, push out more gameplay videos. 
Because, like, literally, because of all this music shit, I have not put out a single gameplay video for almost a week up until yesterday. Well, actually, the day before yesterday, I think. I don't remember. I'd have to look. But, you know, I have other stuff I like to do, too, like my artwork and, you know, my gameplay videos and just hanging out and being normal. Like, you guys don't know how exhausting it is to sit there, or write, and record 24-7, 365 days a year, nonstop. Because if I'm not at my peak best, I'm not going to be able to do 110% of my best. And, you know, when I was sitting down working on, you know, and the song Love is the Darkness with my brother Eric, you know, it made me realize, you know, I need a break. I need to step away from the spotlight for a bit to be normal. Because, you know, I don't want people thinking that I'm that guy that just doesn't take breaks and who doesn't know how to be normal. I want to be that guy that everybody is like, hey, you know, like, this guy may do music, but he also, you know, has a normal, you know, funny, you know, family and friend side. Like, I want to be that person that is successful in music, but also being able to be normal all at the same time. If you guys know what I mean, like, you know, that's what I want. I want to be a successful music artist, yes, but I also want to be able to be myself and be normal all at the same time and not have that pressure of 10 million fucking people deadlining my shit. Like, I need that break, guys. Like, I really do. I don't know if you guys can tell or not, and I'm pretty sure right now you can, but I need that break. So, like I said, from this moment on, starting from right now, this minute, I am stepping away from the music to take a vacation for myself and take a break. And to just hang out with you guys and talk to you guys. And, you know, for all my fans out there that do listen to my music, if you guys would like to send me some kind of fan art or something, message me, please, and I will send you guys my address. And then you guys can message me stuff, man. Because I love to see fan art from you guys. I love to see stuff from you guys. Well, with that being said, guys, I am out of here. I'm going to be working on my artwork and my videos and just relaxing. I'm probably binge-watching YouTube all night like I usually do. But um, don't get me wrong, guys. I'm not quitting music. I'm just taking a very much needed break. But um, I love you guys, and I will see you guys later.